Let's get this over with. All right. If that's not the best wonton soup you've ever had, I will back off. How how sure? So tell him. Tell me what? It's good, right? It's okay. What? Hey, excuse you. Mm. Ecuadorian shrimp, jeju black pork, eggs straight from the ass of a happy hen. It's perfect. Sue, try it. Tao ka mao bing. Yigu gui lao wei. That's right. It doesn't taste like Guangzhou. What? No, ignore Sue, okay? Lucky, you try it again and just be honest. Ta xiang pao ni. Ni jiu rang ha gao xing yi xia happy, huh? Wo ke yi qi casino. English, please. And why do I need all these fancy ingredients for wonton soup? It's a waste of money. It's not about the money. <laughs> no, I didn't. No, I don't. Wait, what is she saying? She's saying that you are a very reckless spender. Mm -hmm. What? How much do the eggs cost? What? You're the one always bragging about your fancy dates. I do not brag about my dates. I'm not talking about the men, okay? I'm. I'm talking about the food. Good food just costs a little more. How much more? Just a little bit more. If you buy in bulk, only two dollars more per dozen. Oh my god, are you insane? Even if this is slightly better than what uh -huh. we serve. So you do admit it's better. See, you heard her, right? In my day, when man, one woman, he make a real move. Take her to the dance club, buy her one cocktail, two cocktail, three cocktail, and one woman, one man, oh, she let him grab the ass. Oh, seven cocktail and the broom closet. Broom. <laughs> <laughs> Do, does she think that I'm? Because I, I, I am, I am not. This is, this is strictly about the soup. This is entirely about the soup. Completely about the soup. You know, um, you could admit to liking the wontons, and, and I won't take it to mean anything other than that. You promise? I promise. I can't. Say it. I can't. Just say it. I really, really like your wontons. Is that why you did your hair? <laughs> no! <laughs> you said you like my wontons. You said you like my wontons. You said you... Yes? I will be deducting the cost of this from your salary. Mm -hmm. Okay. On, you can't be that dumb. <sighs> no condoms in a two vulva. I mean, two plus two equals. Miss Harris, please say something. Bedside manners, Dr. Harris. Wait, Harris, this bitch is your sister? Yes, Dr. Bitch is my sister. Wow, you don't talk about me to your clients. I'm hurt. That's cold. Just a speculum. So, what do you guys talk about in social work? Unprofessional. Social work isn't really confidential, is it? Yes, it is. It's similar to sisters keeping things from their mom. Mm, nope, I'm not telling her about my defective ovary. You got a broken ovary? Damn. It's confidential. Just like you telling me about your boyfriend's sudden condom allergy. <laughs> is that why you're such a bitch? Ow! Pap test complete. As usual, thank you for your time, Sophia.
Can I get meds for the yeast infection already? You don't have a yeast infection. Herpes. Same partner, new herpes? Hmm. You saying my man cheated on me? <laughs> wow, she's smart after all. Ow, Hannah! What the fuck was that in there? You call me down here for an SDI? There's a fetal surgery happening upstairs right now that I should be observing. Instead I get fucking herpes? Mom? And you're avoiding her? Ugh, I wish she would check it on me once in a while. It doesn't count. She's clearly looking for you. So many words to write for herpes. I'm gonna be so fucking late. Sophia, focus. Tell mom about your dead ovary. Slow down and process your shit. I can't slow down. I'm on a tight timeline. Okay, residency, fellowship, black girl, OBGYN, magic shit. And I've been doing some menopause math, by the way. Bitch, what the hell is menopause math? Age minus ovary, subtract declining fertility and hormone variables. Come on. Sophia, do you have to be so anal about everything? Maybe I can try anal when my vagina dries up for menopause in a couple years. Nigga, <laughs> you gave me her oh, oh, God, like that. Baby, Brianna. <laughs> Brianna. Okay, this is amazing. Almost worth my time down here today. Brianna. Only a dumb nigga would cheat on a girl from the Bronx. <laughs> Stop throwing shit in this clip. <laughs>
Magic show with my feet. My GPA is slipping. No. I can't help you. She, you do magic with your feet? And is Thea into that kind of thing? Like feet? Ew, dude. You talk to people like this, you need to touch some grass. Oh. Forget it. I guess you just see what you want to see. Bro, why did you not tell me? If you're looking for feet magic videos, I got a guy, man. Seriously, why are you back? I'm not the guy. Parker, buddy, we need to talk. This is the guy? Why are you always tripping, man? This guy actually looks like he fucks. You don't. I guess we all look the same. Even to each other. Right, Parker? Sure, Ben. I'll go out with you. Oh, there are Don't be mad. It was an emergency. Hello, what the shit? She found your edibles? I told you to lock your bedroom door! No, no, I did, I did. I locked myself out too, and I could hella use an edible right now, but no, no, that's not it! I lost my rabbit! You're better with this stuff! You have, you know... Ovaries? Stoner intuition. No, no, no. Ben's outside. He's waiting for me. We touched hands. It was magical. I did that thing where I rubbed my hands together and I touched him, so there was for sure a spark. I have to get back out there. I want Mr. Flops! You should never have trusted me to look after her. I killed my cactus last week, Devi. A cactus. I don't even remember getting a cactus. It could have just been a really old pickle that I put in a pod. You good? That's a whole new perspective. <laughs> okay, you go get that D. <gasps> I will take her home. Yes! yes. Sometimes. I just want to know when she's coming back. I didn't mean to make a mess. Uh, I'm better than this. Oh, you're better than me, girl. I throw a tantrum every time I'm tired. Or hungry. Or afraid that my youth is fading. Ugh, it's because I'm a Sagittarius. Are you in there with someone else? Um, no, just a burly woman. You know, it's probably morning in India. Why don't we give your mom a call? Debbie, I'm heading out. Oh, God, so needy. But you should go after him. No, I should take her home. Hi, Janu. It's so dark there. Where are you? Um, a bar? Put Devi on the phone. Now.
You know, we could probably find a way to get rid of them ourselves, but nowadays you gotta think about how it looks and all that. White people, immigrant ghosts. <laughs> Optics are extremely important. The last thing you want is to be accused of being xenophobic or insensitive. Exactly. Anyway, give me a holler when you get this oriental spooky shit sorted out, huh? You said this was a cleaning job. It is. We're cleaning the place of ghosts. A little spectral dusting, if you will. I will not. Well, unless you got a better way of making three months back rent by Sunday. I don't know if this is a good idea. Ooh, EMF reader. Ha <laughs> ha, spectral vacuum. Temple water and... Incense. Where'd you get these? Chinatown. I'm at the electronics. Chinatown. You can find anything there. Picked all this up with the advance we got. Oh, even got a discount on the card. What advance? You made us business cards? Well, yeah, we gotta look legit if we're gonna keep doing this. Well, we're not legit, and you said that this was a one and done. Okay, nope. Dude, this is the perfect untapped market. White people have no idea how to deal with Asian ghosts. Dude, we have no idea how to deal with any ghosts. I watched a bunch of clips online. Spritz some holy water, suck up some spiritual residue. Easy peasy. Whoa. <laughs> See? That was like a month's rent right there. Ooh. I'm pretty sure that show was a moth! In Japanese culture, spirits often return as moths and butterflies. I read it on Wikipedia. Whoa. Incense. Look, we are in way over our heads right now. Maybe we should just... Maybe we should just call your mom. Are you kidding me? She lose her mind. No, yeah, superstitious she is. Listen, we have everything we need right here. Hey, you're the one that's always going on about money. Financial freedom is just one squeeze away. Hey, man, it's going off. There's another grand. It's all just leftover spectral energy. Instead of Casper, it's Chunkpok, the friendly ghost. Same, same. Okay, that did not look friendly. Jesus Christ, what are we gonna do? I got this. <laughs> even Google. Thank you.